In recent years, we have observed climate changes such as intensified heavy rain and excessive heat, as well as increased damage due to these changes. One cause is carbon dioxide, CO2. Prime Minister Yoshihide Suga declared that by 2050, Japan will aim to realize a carbon neutral society. To attain this goal, it is necessary not only to implement various measures, such as to make renewable energy the main power source, or to take innovative energy saving measures, but also to capture, utilize, and store the CO2 that is still emitted. That is to say, CCUS technology. Here, we see several CCUS projects of the Ministry of the Environment Japan aimed toward a decarbonized society. Capture. This large-scale CO2 verification equipment at a biomass power plant captures more than 500 tons of CO2 per day and is the world's first large-scale BEX-compatible facility. In addition, technology to directly capture CO2 in the atmosphere with low energy consumption is also under development. Utilization. Saga City is the first city in Japan to capture CO2 from a waste incineration plant. They have already started to utilize the high purity CO2 at agricultural facilities. This is artificial photosynthesis technology to produce syngas, which is a mixture of carbon monoxide, CO, and hydrogen from CO2 and water. It is close to attaining as high as 10% solar energy conversion efficiency, the world's highest class, by using earth abundant metals as catalysts. This high throughput CO2 electrolysis cell generates tons of CO from CO2 with the world's fastest processing speed using a unique catalytic electrode. We are also developing technology to produce methane from the CO2 emitted from waste incineration plants to store and utilize as an alternative fuel for power plants and automobiles. And technology to produce ethanol from CO2 through methods such as microbial fermentation. In this way, the Ministry of the Environment Japan is seeking a way not only to capture CO2, but also to utilize it as an essential resource for our life. By integrating CO2 into the resource cycle, we aim to realize a society independent of fossil fuels.